Hey guys, I'm Louise from Popeye Supplements. I'm here at Kenneth's location today for a healthy recipe and I brought two friends, April hey. and Akil. Hey. All right, so what are we gonna make today? So today we're gonna make what we call Team Buff from Team Pudding. This is uh, pretty much our go-to snack. We've both been living off of it for five, six years yeah. now. Uh, some of my coworkers make fun of me, but that's just because they don't know and what are we gonna eat today? Well, you're gonna start with your favorite protein. Mine is magnum quattro. I like the chocolate. And then we're gonna add um, natural crunchy peanut butter. I like the crunchy one because it really adds a lot of texture to your pudding. Right, what else? So we've also got uh, powdered peanut butter. This is pretty much my favorite product for the entire store. Uh, today we're going to be using BioX Nutrinut, which is available in a Popeye's value size. Uh, and I've got the chocolate flavor today because I really can't get enough chocolate. <laughs> Me too. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know. You know. Uh, and then our last thing is uh, Himalayan pink salt. So we got the flavor garden one today. Uh, this is a very overlooked ingredient, just a little bit. It's going to add quite a lot of texture, uh, even a little bit of flavor. Yeah. Let's get started. We're gonna start with the dry ingredients. So we got one scoop of protein. Okay, so then we're gonna do uh, 12 grams of Nutri-Nut. That is one serving. We got two tablespoons of peanut butter. That's the important part. The best part. Oops. Yeah, well, I'll eat that. <laughs> Nothing goes to waste here. And then, <laughs> it's true. And just, uh, just a touch. Just a bit. We're gonna add our water, but we're gonna do it slowly because if we add too much, it'll make it just too runny. So, add a little bit and start whipping it with a fork. The idea is that you want it to get a consistency that's like pudding or, uh, or like icing. So you want it to be thick, but not too thick. You want it to be malleable, but not too runny. It's gotta be, it's gotta be just right. And the key ingredient to making it that consistency is actually the nutrient. If you just use a, a protein, it'll be too runny. So the nutrient really adds that, that thickness to it. The je ne sais quoi. Yeah. I was just coming out with really little. This is a great alternative to desserts like ice cream. It's my go-to when I feel like I need a little treat. So once you got the perfect consistency, not too runny, not too thick, as you can see here, you can pour it into a bowl and then put it in your freezer for two to three hours and it'll come out just like ice cream. Sometimes you need to microwave it for seven to 10 seconds just to get it like, soft enough to dig into. But yeah, it's so good. Hi, perfect timing! Yeah, you guys well. did everything and now I'm gonna try it! <laughs> kind of jealous, you might be lying. Oh man, can't wait to hear. Oh my god! <laughs> right? It was so good! Now you know. This is real. Like this is uh she has never tried this. I'm before. not gonna share it at all. And <laughs> mm -hmm. we're just Bye, gonna have guys. to Oh, okay. <laughs>